Okay, start firing. Okay, pick your targets, gentlemen. Pick your targets. Okay, here we are. Now let's hope this has more effect than uh, our, our previous attempts. Alright, he doesn't have any grenades. He does, he does, but he just has normal ones. Uh, fragmentation. Yeah, that's not gonna help, buddy. But wait. No, no, no. Yes! An RD-33 grenade. Was this a rifle grenade? Alright, go. <laughs> he still wants to chuck the grenade, but he doesn't have a shot. Alright. Go. And hopefully... Ah, one of the tanks of the enemy has been disabled. That's excellent. Okay, now hopefully... The uh, other tank here will uh, also uh, be in trouble. Come on, chuck it! Chuck it! Yes! Oh. Nope, nothing of the sort. Okay, well, at least we are not, uh... Alright. Don't hold your fire any longer, just fire away. Start zapping them. Do we still have the four other tanks? Yes, we do. Okay, good. That will help. Alright, now what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna command oh, yeah. my tanks to actually hit the top of the enemy tanks, yeah. because that will take the teeth out. and potentially hit their um, hit their ammo supply and that yeah. will give a nice bang especially with all these bunched up units here so hopefully that will do what I want it to do right, you. you will aim at these guys you'll do it now yeah. I want some concentrated fire please yeah. thank you very much concentrate the fire now the Russian troops in World War II were actually one of the best trained troop, troops in the world when it came to tank war, warfare because they practiced uh, with the Germans before they uh, actually went to war with them so that's uh, pretty amazing considering alright now they're firing at my infantry that's done gonna get their tank mangled hopefully come on hit it yes that's it alright hit the cupola yeah. and Here's another one. Okay, pick your targets, gentlemen. Pick them and pick them good. Alright, they're gonna get coaxual, I guess. Yeah. And okay, they can't see anything, yeah. they can't see anything. I just got at them. Alright. Hold position. Okay. Taking out the tanks is, uh, is basically what we uh, what we need. Shoot that commander. And yeah, just area fire right here. I don't care if you hit anything. And you guys do the same. Area fire over here. There they are. Okay. All right. They took out one of our tanks, I'm afraid. Yeah, they did. This is going <laughs> slightly worse than I expected, but all right. Yeah, yeah let's hit the, hit the front one there. Oil. You Oil. also hit the front one there. Okay, my infantry is really killing them. Alright. Yep, there we go. That's the last of those tanks. Perfect. And we have three tanks left. But no reinforcements. That might become a problem. Eventually. Uh, okay. Alright. 
Yeah, they're hitting us with the high explosive shells now. Not really a problem. Okay. Here comes another another I'm gonna zoom into that if you so that you can have a good look at what I'm facing. Alright. Okay, this is like a Panzer two. It only had like a, a, a 20 millimeter s speed fire, rapid fire cannon, something. These are crewmen of the uh, destroyed tanks getting out of there. They simply don't want to stick around, I guess. Alright. I think he's moving his tank in to actually do something against my men. That's not very nice. It's not very nice at all. Can you guys see him? Boy. You can't. He can, probably. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, yeah. Oh, these guys can. Alright, well, uh, fall back, I guess. Just walk. No, wait. Just run over there. Just go, 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 go. Run, run, run. I don't need you here. I need you on the other side of the battlefield. There we are. Per that's you perfect. Yeah. Now we can aim for the last tank. Yeah. And hopefully take it out. Yeah. Okay. Yes, they can see him. That's perfect. Alright. Okay, the, f the last bits of infantry here. Shoot him. Kill him with your bare hands if you have to. Oh, good. He did. <laughs> I don't know. I think he threw a rock at him or something. Or one of these troops hit him. The ones with the red icons here, uh, they're wounded. He's critically wounded, this guy. His, uh, his name is Prokhor Mirnov. And he's uh, in some real trouble, uh, just like Igor Lobanov. I don't know if you can read this, probably not. But uh, all right, so this was the first wave. Um, yeah, we are in, uh, in in some really serious trouble because I've lost more tanks than I wanted to, and obviously that's not a good thing. All right, I'm gonna face them this way, or this way, I don't care. And you guys, okay? They, they this this one has been hit in the tracks. Um, if I if I keep my mouse here and you look at the little um, thing on the right here, you can see there's a, a red dot, probably, in, in YouTube you can't see. There's a, a little red dot in the first marker in its uh, unit description on the right here. If I move my mouse, it's gone. Um, and it's, uh, it basically means it has no tracks anymore. You can't see it, but uh, take it from me, that's what happened. That's, which is kind of weird because I told my tanks to uh, to aim for the um, <laughs> and aim for the higher bits of the tank, and not the lower bits of the tank. So um, yeah. oh, these guys haven't fired yet. They're still set to don't fire. Oops, that explains why we lost those tanks. But okay, all right, that's all right. No worries. Wait a minute. If it lost its tracks. We can probably reach you. You, you're gonna be our... No, wait. We need somebody with that. Yes. <laughs> Get going. Get going now. You will move. And you will, you will take out... Oh, no, never mind. Nope, nope, they left. Never mind. Stop. You can stop now. Reinforcements have arrived. Perfect. Now to position them. Yes, perfect now. Now I know if I'm gonna run them through the village, there's more troops from the Germans coming from this hill later, I think. And um, yeah, that could become a real problem. So uh, they know I'm here now. <laughs> That's uh, basically the uh, issue we're facing. And they're gonna try and push through the village. Another issue we're facing. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna position them here, I think. Somewhere around here in this wooded area. Where they can't be seen, but they do have a nice view of uh, things. Yeah. There we go. Just drive over here. Yeah. Alright. Boy. Okay. And hopefully, they'll remain unseen. Alright, boys, move, move up. BT7s. Love ya. Alright. Yep, here's there a tree went down over here. You have to be real careful in this game and <laughs> keep watch at everything. And uh I think I'm gonna move this guy. He has kept silent all this time. I think I'm gonna move him. Then again I could use him as a good flanking unit. So 
I'm gonna make sure he doesn't fire. And so you and this guy, I'm gonna sort of silence their guns for now. Right. So this guy, uh, the guy in the middle, this one, he's uh, yeah. he spotted them together with the infantry. They're gone now. Well, you can take it from me that they spotted them. All right, all of you, stop, cease fire and stop, and stay there. Stay alive. That's basically also what we need. Alive units are better than dead ones. All right, so stay alive. Please, do me a favor. Oh my God, these these tanks are making so much trouble with for me. <laughs> because they're they're knocking over trees, and that sort of stands out. If you know what I mean? All right, so you guys hold position. You can fire at them if you want, but don't move. You'll be better off, believe me. Okay, we're gonna do a little flanking action Boy. with this one. I hope he survives. Um, yeah. yeah. Just sort of move to his corner. There we go. Okay. Yeah, okay, well, so we've lost sight of the Germans. That's generally a good sign. They're gonna move down the hill. They're gonna regret doing so. Because we are ready for them. We are so ready for them. Hold on, who sees what? You see this guy? Yes, you can. Alright, aim for the top of the tank again. I want to aim for the top. I don't want to immobilize them yet. They're still mobile. And I just want those lucky shots. Those lovely lucky shots that will get me exactly what I want. And that is a, a nice a German explosion. There we go. That was a direct hit. I don't know if you could see that. But this guy aimed at this guy. And uh, yeah, that really gave him a good punch right there. Okay, now I'm gonna tell this guy to hold position as well. Okay. Alright. Whoa! These guys are firing over the hill. That's not very nice. Except for the part where you can't hit me. <laughs> Oh dear, now I'm taking punishment here. Alright, they fired, he fired his, whoa, oh my god. Wow, that BT-7 returned fire and actually hit this guy in the front and took him out. I don't know if I can zoom on this, but... Okay, the, the guy I had on the corner, that got fired upon from far away, he just took out this tank here. Bang! It's gone. Look, the crew members are, co are coming out here. They're, they don't want to fight anymore. They're, they're just they're gonna call it quits for now. All right. So the uh, German other German Panzers have reached the town, and that means we can get into some action here with the uh, already stationed units. And as far as they can see them, because I don't know if they can. Well, this one might be able to. Does it yeah. see them? No, we don't. What about the one in the middle? He doesn't see the knife. Oh, well. Alright, we're gonna hold until he does. And, um... Yeah, I don't think... I was planning on taking this one back, but I'm not gonna do that. Because this was such a good shot, 